what are gravitational waves? I like to think of a gravitational wave as being a ripple in the fabric of space. So uh, we can think of space as being like the surface of a uh, lake on a very calm day. And uh, you stick your finger in, you stir around, and you create ripples that go traveling out. Somebody on the other side of the lake might even see those ripples go by and try to guess what produced it, whether it was your finger or whether it was some bird. Uh, so gravitational waves are rather similar, but it's not ripples on the surface of a pond, it's ripples in the fabric of space. But if you ask me to explain what space is, I sort of throw up my hands and say, well, I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> but I can write down mathematical equations that describe it. So in some sense, space is the arena in which we live. Uh, it is, uh, obviously, it's the stuff between you and me. Uh, we can, uh, uh, physicists for a long time thought of that as space as being sort of empty and there isn't anything there. In the modern era, we understand that space is a very rich thing. It has little quantum fluctuations going on in it. It can support these waves of, of uh, stretching and squeezing, which is what a gravitational wave is. Gravitational wave stretches and squeezes space, uh, and things ride on that stretching and squeezing space so that if you have uh, two objects, say, out in space, just floating there, one here and one there, and a gravitational wave comes by, they'll move back and forth relative to each other because space is stretching and squeezing in between them. Well, they are more similar to sound than light in, from the point of view of the detectors that we are using in LIGO. Uh, that is, the detectors are looking at waves that are in the same, have the, roughly the same frequencies as sound rather than these extremely high frequencies of light. But just as the uh, music from an orchestra playing Beethoven's Fifth uh, it carries a lot of information, not only emotional information, but information about the instruments that are uh, playing the music. In the same way, the gravitational waves that we will detect carry a huge amount of information, information about aspects of the universe that we have never, ever seen.